Today we're going to look at lattice multiplication as a strategy for long multiplication. The first step is knowing how many digits you have in your number. 45 has two digits and 6 has one digit. So we're going to draw a lattice, which is just a fancy box that will hold two digits times one digit. The last step is drawing a diagonal line that goes through the box and out the other side. This is to help organize your numbers and it will be handy when you're adding later. We're ready to multiply. It does not matter if you start with the 4 or the 5 when you're doing this. However, it's a good habit to always start on the right. 5 times th 6 is 30. So we write our two digits, the 3 and the 0, on either side of that diagonal line in the box. That was these numbers. 4 times 6 is 24. And again, we write them on either side of the box. Now we're ready to add. When we're adding, we're only adding the blue numbers, not the numbers on the outside of the box. So this diagonal line represents a column. In this column, the only blue number is 0, so we put it down here. In this column, we have 4 and 3, so when they're added together, we get 7. And in this column, we have a 2. So that means our result of 45 times 6 is 270. Let's try another number. 762 times 4. This time we have three digits. That means our lattice also needs to have room for three digits. It can take a little practice to draw them, so sometimes it helps to put your numbers up first and then draw the lattice in. But don't forget those diagonal lines. Don't start multiplying until you have them. All right, we're ready to multiply. So we have 2 times 4 is 8. Because 8 is only has one digit, we must put a 0 in front of it to hold the place so that we don't put a number in there accidentally. 6 times 4 is 24. Again, on either side of that box. And 7 times 4 is 28. Now that we're done multiplying, and we're sure that those are all correct, we're going to add our blue numbers. So in this column, we have just an 8. In this column, we have 0 plus 4, which is still 4. In this column, we have 2 plus 8, which is 10. So we put the 0, and we carry the 1 over to the other column. 1 plus 2, 3. So the result is 3,048. Now it's time for you to try one to see if you can build it on your own. So the question is 39 times 6. Pause the video and draw a lattice. All right, does your lattice have two boxes times one box? And did you remember those diagonal lines? If you did, you're ready to try multiplying. Pause the video and multiply. All right, we have 9 times 6 is 54. 3 times 6 is 18. Does your multiplication look like mine? If not, go back and check. You can't go on until your multiplication is correct. All right, it's time to add. Pause the video, do your adding, and then come back to check. So we have 4 in this column. We have 5 plus 8 is 13. There's the 3. We carry that 1 over to the next column. 1 plus 1 is 2. So 234. If you got it correct, congratulations. If not, there's still room to keep trying. Good luck.